Hey, this is Butterfly coming to you from your Pima County, Arizona, Mexican border. So um, God is uh, moving me to different ops for a little bit, but this still needs your attention. Everything is laid out. I have a volunteer down here, amazing, knows how things are run, knows what's going on, and in Yeshua's name, more volunteers will be showing up. We are still running operations down here. We've got five miles of wall, two cartels. We have immigrants coming through and normally many, many children coming through. Now, as far as I understand, and I will keep you up to date, still running ops, I'm just gonna be in a different location. We have hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of children that have come through. Also other children that are in trouble and we are locating and getting these children to safety and taking care of them. I'm going to be handling that from a different location for a while. As these children are coming through the border, as border ops are still running, volunteers are still needed. Get a hold of me, 509-263-4612. I will be here as far as video and phone calling to help out, but also I've got a volunteer down here right now knows how things are run, knows how things are needed. We have many, many different ops that we're doing. From this location at the border, we've got um, everything from humanitarian aid as these children come through, to picking up the trash, to um, uh, um, militia type work out in the field. We've got cartel coyotes running supplies and drugs in that we, we, we have many ops that we're handling and to keep an eye on how many kids are coming through where they're coming through and where we can step in and get them off the traffic line so please call me or text me info.vop at protonmail.com is going to give you a supply list we've got a couple camps um, alpha is set up and supplied for comfort it's 40 miles up down here at the border your facilities are the desert. Whatever you bring is what you have. We do have donors and uh, donors keeping those gas cards coming. We're very, very low on those and gift cards. And then um, we'll keep you up to date with other supplies that are needed for our volunteers to keep them comfortable, to keep them doing what they need to be doing at this part of the traffic line. And uh, also, I'll be getting to you. I will continue videotaping. and I will continue to let you know updates of where these kids are, what's going on. Um, some of these kids will be uh, more, more privately handled uh, for their safety's sake. But as much as possible, I will be documenting and updating for you to see, uh, in Jesus' name, praise reports of these little ones. So let's keep the operations running. Uh, anybody who's interested in helping, we need your help from here all the way into your neighborhood. So Spanish speakers, huge. Um, that is the big major language we're working with right here. The traffic line is very, very Latino based. Um, any kind of language that you know help, helps because children are trafficked in, in many different um, so mostly this is our country and we're going to deal with the trafficking that's going on uh, on our grounds because the blood's on our hands. Once again, as I've said, we've done this. We allowed it to get this far. Now we got to stand up and do something about it. Our Lord and Savior, our God, the one who created us, the God of the Bible, of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, who we look up to for strength to get through what we see down here and what we're handling down here and the horrors of it. He gives us the power, the tools, everything we need to do his work. We are his hands and feet. We work with our Father. We work with our Father in heaven, and he gives us the strength, and he gives us the tools, and we help these children. Every child matters. Whether it's one, whether it's two, whether it's 10, 20, hundreds, in Jesus' name it's hundreds, let's stop child trafficking. We can do this. I have had people say, oh, this has been going on for years. Yes, it has. Shame on you for not getting involved. Um, shame on me for taking so long to get involved. Um, I've heard, oh, it's too big, it's too huge, there's nothing we can do. You're right. There is nothing you can do on your own. You need 
the God who created you to give you the strength and the power to do what we need to do down here. So put him first and let him guide you into what you need to be doing. Whether you're a prayer warrior, whether you're a frontline warrior, whether you're a donor, whatever you're doing, America, let's get together and stop trafficking in this country. <sighs> All right, that said, Lord, I just thank you that you're moving. I thank you that we're, you're moving and we're trusting in you because we're putting it all down. We're putting it all down. We're repenting for what brought us here. We're repenting for the horrors we put our children through that our children can't even be children anymore. Even, even in our own front yard. We are calling innocents back. We are getting these kids to safety. Families are getting their children back. Children are going to safe houses and safe families. And God, you are bringing the people needed to make this happen. You will be glorified, and we are grateful for that. We want to see you glorified in this. We want to see the miracles. We want to know that it was you, and it is you, God, and we need you. So with that said, amen. God bless you all. We need you. Come down here. Help out at our border. Um, if you want to find out other ways you can help, get a hold of me, 509-263-4612. I also have links. Uh, if you're on my YouTube, look through it. I have documented these children coming through. I have documented everything. So you can look through under under uh, my border list. is going to start from my first time at the border till till today. So you can go through and, and see, you know, three kids came through, four kids came through, 38 kids came through. And you can see updates on, on uh, I'll explain, some of these are just me talking like I am now, but the, that talking can be an update on children that came through and what ended up happening with them or, or a child that came through or, or what the cartels are doing or what we're doing as veterans on patrol. If you need any clarity, I try to label my videos accordingly so that you can look up what you need to. So God bless you all. Um, butterfly out. <laughs>